Hey everybody, uh, thanks for coming to watch. So, as you can see, we have an update on uh, Nicole. Um, unfortunately, last night I went through Florida killing six, and it's uh, going to continue up the um, East Coast. But uh, yeah, we're, we're gonna show you what to expect. So this is around 1 p.m. So in a couple, in two hours, one hour maybe, um, it's going to be just reaching New York. It, we just, we just, just had, like, we just, yeah. We, we just had a couple of rain showers just. Yeah, we had some showers recently, um, maybe part of the outer bands that kind of detached, wasn't anything. Uh, too severe. Too I severe, mean, we yeah. had it on and off twice already. Yeah, it's and we're just so you know, guys, we're on Long Island right here. I just zoomed on it. Um, this is at 1 p.m. Now we, we get started. To send 7 p.m. 7 p.m. tonight. Look, we're definitely gonna get a little bit more. Yeah, look because at because of this yellow heading into New Jersey. We're probably gonna get a little bit of that. Mm -hmm. You can we're see a little closer. You can see here, uh, we're right here. Um, I'm gonna be filming this, by the way, when it comes up. Uh, we have a chance of severe storms when this cluster of storms gets up here. It's not a tornado. And. Um, you can see upstate New York, you guys are going to get hammered four to six inches of rain. Yeah. Not joking, uh, lots of flooding possible. Um, but yeah, and it's also going to be very windy. So on the coast, uh, um, Definitely watch out. Definitely a lot out. of rain, watch out. More, more north. The more yeah. north you are on the east coast, the more wind. Yeah, so more Long wind. Island, 50, 60 miles an hour. Long Island, uh, Cape Cod, Massachusetts, you guys could see definitely a 50, a 50 55 mile an hour wind gust. Uh, um tonight and then we uh go into uh later um hours this is Ten, middle um, of the night tonight uh not middle of the night when we it have well, yeah so we have uh more of these storms uh going through the area um as you just can see it's going to it's going to break up uh it's going to be disorganized the more north it goes this might be our eye right here, guys, as you can see, because pretty much center of the storm, and the eye looks pretty good on radar. But yeah, we definitely have uh, lots of um, storms uh, by our low pressure, and it's going to get pretty rough out there. So heading into m tomorrow at 7 a.m. Tomorrow, 7 a.m., we're moving out. Uh, some heavy rain, uh, downpours, but not really that bad and we move out and, and then, then we're done and so then we have snow then we have up. some some snow uh in uh western pennsylvania you guys could see some snow hooray um i guess you guys are pretty done with the uh, uh summer and the um hurricane season so we'll go to the spaghetti model the uh possible tracks for the storm <sighs> you can see there's lots and lots and lots of uh, possible tracks um, that kind of it stays it stays pretty uh, close to the coast. Pretty close to the coast. Pretty stays much the same. But you can see here what's interesting. Now, once it uh, passes um, Maine, it gets kind of weird because it moves out. You can see here it. Um, Keeps on going straight, takes a dip, and then goes north, which is would would be very bizarre. And then it like cuts back, um, yeah. to the east a little bit. Yeah. And then it comes back down. So it's gonna be very weird. We don't. We really don't know for sure where it's gonna go. If it's gonna go more coast or if it's going to go farther inland. As of now, we're saying it's gonna go farther inland, but I definitely do say that. Uh, um, upstate New York, you guys are gonna get lots and lots and lots of rain. So and stay safe and um. Yeah, northwestern PA we'll definitely. Keep you, um, updated. Yeah. Here's the European model. I'll just set this back. So, uh, as you can see, we're here at 7 a.m. Uh, this was this morning. Um, uh, not the European model shows less rain, and doesn't get that bad until when it gets more north. This is 1 a.m. tonight. This is lots and lots of rain. This is two inches every hour. So like I said, upstate New York, 
uh, Western Pennsylvania, tons and tons of rain. Right here. This so is like what, two to four inches of rain? Yeah, two tonight? to four inches. Every hour? No, not every hour, but uh, definitely possible for in total. Yeah. Then the storm just moves out. We have the snow that the um, GFS showed, but the European is just showing uh, just rain showers. So we'll go to the winds now. So, east coast, the more north you go, Long Island, Cape Cod, uh, even uh, into some parts of Connecticut uh, on the water, you guys could see 45, 50, maybe even 55 mile an hour wind gusts around 10 p.m. tonight. So, and then as you see in the ocean, we get definitely more higher yeah speeds. so what's interesting though is that what's interesting though is that um the farther out to sea you go the uh um the uh more winds you get because i mean really it may it would make sense if the winds were farther inland because we have the storm here would because it's very weird um, we have our eye kind of right here because you can see it's circling. It's almost like a whirlpool circling into the eye right there. So then we'll, um, sorry for the background noises. Uh, I'm actually doing this outside. Um, but yeah, as we, this is Saturday at 1 a.m., um, but I'll go back. All right, this is where we get started. Uh, we got 28 miles an hour just off of the shore. Uh, 60 miles inland, uh, 14 miles an hour, but this is not a madhouse yet. 20, see miles, 20 an hour. mile an hour winds. Long Island, you guys can see. Around, PM. I would say for Long Island, around 25 mile an hour sustained winds, and yeah. then wind gusts around 40 to 45, 50 mile an hour. And then Ma miles an hour, sorry. To Saturday. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Uh, it, it kind of just loses it and uh, gets quickly out of here. It's going to be a very fast-moving storm, but kind of loses it Saturday. and get then higher. Yeah, but this is uh, more, again, the, yeah. the farther on the coast you are, then the more winds, especially for the north. Yeah. Then we just kind of get away from it, and then we're done. Yeah. So thanks for coming to watch, guys. Um, I hope you... Uh, um, stay safe and enjoy. enjoyed this uh, video on our update. Um, stay, stay safe out there, you guys, and uh, make sure you take this storm seriously. Not, it's not be just because it's a um, tropical depression doesn't mean it can be dangerous. So, yeah, definitely take this seriously. So, see you guys later. Bye.